Hello, in this video, you are going to be learning how to access your AIM course and how to access your Prompton account. All right, it's quite easy, you just need to follow my instructions. Yeah, now, uh, when you get the AIM course, all right, I believe you must have gotten this email from um, from Prompton. So you can check your email now if you've not already checked your email. Check your email for this message from Prompt N. Okay. Now, once you see this message from Prompt N, the next thing is to click it open. All right, to open it. Now, the instructions on how to access your AIM course and also your Prompt N account is quite easy. But I strongly suggest that you watch it to the end. All right, because if you don't watch it to the end, you might not be accessed. Maybe like one of the things. So watch it to the end to know how to access your AIM course and Prompt N account. All right. Now you will get a message like this. Mm -hmm. Now the first thing you want to do, all right, the first thing we're going to be talking about is how to access your aim course. How to access your aim course. Now in, in accessing your aim course, the first thing we are going to be doing, you can see it says it says here's a link to register and automatically access your aim course. So the first thing we're going to be doing to access our aim course is to click this place. We're going to be registering our details all right so this place that it says click here to register the first thing you are going to be doing is to click this place that says click here to register so in this place you will put your name let me use that you put your email let me use a random email um let me use assume a math this one is not an active email at gmail.com all right now when choosing a password it is best to choose a password that you can easily remember all right, because you don't want to complicate the whole process by forgetting your password. So I will just go with one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then I will choose. I will click on sign up. Now, perfect. Now, when you are trying to register, uh, register. When you do this process of trying to register your account, two things can happen. The first is that it will automatically take you to the course. And you you will get access to the course. I will we'll get there soon. Or you will see an error like this. You might see any form of error. Maybe the email is already being used. Don't even if even if it says the email is already being used. Don't worry. All right. If you get any form of error like this, maybe the email is associated with another account. All right. Um. Or and click here on reset. Click here on the reset password to reset the password. Or you might even get a message saying the email is already being used. Or any 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 form of any form of error. Once you get any form of error when trying to register, all right, don't panic. It's a very easy process. What we want to do is that we want to reset the password and try to log in again. Yeah, we want to reset the password. So how do we reset the password? We will right on this page. We will click on this login this login link here. Yeah, we we'll click on login. Then you will type your email here. You type your correct email. Make sure it's the correct email. Okay, no, no, we, we click on login, then we'll click on retrieve. Sorry about that. Um, we don't, we should not be typing our email here. We click on retrieve, all right, because uh, we are clicking on retrieve because we are trying to reset our password, all right. Um, yeah, so we'll click on retrieve, yeah. And then you might say, okay, um, okay, but I already chose the password I've not even used, but don't worry, all right. Any form of, any form of error it gives you, you want to reset the password. So we click on retrieve. Then we put you put in your email here. Let me use the math at gmail.com. You put in your email here. Then you click on change password. So it says please check your email for next step. So as is, as I have shown this check your email, what we want to do is that we want to check our email, alright, for a mess for a link. Um to help us reset our password yeah now here's the link now sometimes this link that this um message from prompt 10 that says password recovery request for you to reset the password sometimes it comes late don't worry yeah sometimes it can take like two minutes three minutes yeah but wait till like let's say i guess five minutes within the next five minutes it should come in all right so sometimes it doesn't come automatically so we'll click on the link here then we'll click on this thing that says change password here and then we put in a new password. Now remember I said that, remember I said your password keep it simple. So my new password, I'm going to be choosing six five four three two one. Six five four three two one. Then I'll click on change password. Good. 
now we have successfully changed our password the next thing we want to do is that you can see it it took us to the login login page the next thing we want to do is to type our email here type our email here let me type your correct email here let me use osmanmath at gmail.com then type your new password here 654321 then click on login perfect we've now accessed the aim course all right now whenever you want to log into the aim course yeah whenever after you want to log into the aim course yeah you will use this link whenever you want to log into the aim course you will use this link now you can see there's the second the second link here says click here to login click here to log in login it says after registration you can always you can always log in using the link below so whenever you want to log in to access your aim course you are going to be using this yeah so you will click here to log in you put in your you put in your correct email you put in your correct password the login whenever you have any issue with login maybe it shows um password uh, incorrect or error don't worry the uh, um the issue can be solved by just retrieving by just clicking on retrieving to reset your password you understand so you click here to log in now here's the aim course let me tell you briefly on how to use the aim course yeah now when you log into the place you can see it says ensure you don't share the link with anyone or or or, or else your access to it will be revoked all right so when you share the aim course with someone you may be surprised that tomorrow you come and they say you can no longer log in yeah but the first thing you want to do is that you want to click here you want to click this place to join the telegram group chat all right there is a telegram support group chat so you click here to join the telegram support, uh, telegram support group chat all right now the aim course consists of different lessons yeah we have the this uh, this place is where you find all the courses all the scripts now along the training line you will be hearing something like um click on that for the ebook click on that for the class scripts for the copy and paste script yeah so there's nothing for you to check on that yeah just come to this section that says all courses script and ebook you will find it there now, like I said, the M course consists of different sections. We have the, the script section, all right. We have the M course itself. We have the Facebook advertisement section. We have the Heart for Business. We have Twitter organic. How to attract massive leads on Twitter. We have how to get your um, Facebook account Facebook account back. We have how to get um, people on Google. We have the website creation. We have LinkedIn, all right. Then when you scroll down. Yeah, it's not all when you scroll down, you have TikTok. Yeah, how to grow massively on TikTok and get lots of buying people from TikTok. We have the video editing course, we have landing page course. All right. Now, don't get confused by all these places. This is confused. Where should I start from? When you're just starting, when you're, when you're just entering your account, you have no business with all these things. The first thing you want to focus on is this M M in M in course M M um, income course. That's the first thing you want to focus on. Don't worry about this one. All right. Don't worry about this one. Yeah. Focus on this one first. Aim, aim, aim income cost. So you click on it. All right. There's no, there's no need to even click on it because it's, it's automatically brought you to that page. Yeah. So in this aim income course, you have 25 videos. 25 videos. So when you're done, when you're done with this section, you just do, just click next. All right. You click next. Yeah. To take to the next section. Let me click previous. Yeah. So what you want to do is that you want to start watching this video one after the other. Hello, you are all right. So when I don't watch this video, all right, you go to the next video. Once I don't watch this video, you go to the next video. And most importantly, in the video, there are like three assignments for you. So it's very, very important that you do this, that you do those assignments before you go to the next video. All right. So take it step by step, step by step, step by step, step by step. Yeah. So when you're done, you click next to go to the next section. Like this is this is one to five. When you're done, you go to the next section for six, five, seven, eight, ten. All right, like that. So take it step by step, watch and follow the instructions. Yeah. So that is um a bit. Now as you watch the M course, all right, you will not know in the M course. Yeah, you will not know which one you want to follow next. What I want to whether what I want to study TikTok or Facebook. All right. But the first thing you want to you want to study is the aim course itself all right now that is that for access and uh, for accessing your aim course now let me show you how to access your prompting account let me show you how to access your prompting account now you can see this message here says 
your PromChain account has been automatically created for you. Your default password is 123456. Log in with your email by clicking the button below. Now, if you want to access your your your, your, com, your PromChain account has been created for you automatically. All right. If you want to log in with if you want to access your PromChain account, yeah. The first thing you want to do is that you will click this place to access your prompt and affiliate account. Okay, so you click here. So once you click, once you click here, yeah. Um, like uh, it has been said, if you look at the email, all right, the email said that your default password is one two three four five six. Your default password that means your account already. Your account has already been created for you with one, two, three, four, five, six as the password. You understand? So you will click, you will come to this place. All right, that says um, access to your personal account. You will type in your email here. All right, you will type in your email here. You see my math at gmail.com. All right, then you will put the default password one, two, three, four, five, six. Then you will click on login. You can see we logged in, all right. So in this place, the, the uh, you have to you have to answer this question that says, "How did you hear about prompting?" So you will click on your answer. So let me let me choose. Um, let's say let's say I heard about prompting from TikTok. I will choose on TikTok. I'll click on proceed. All right. So we are here. All right. We are here. This is our dashboard. Yeah. This is the dashboard. Yeah. Now let me go back. Let's assume that you are trying to log into your Prompton account and it shows a form of error that you cannot log in. Don't worry, any any form of error at all can be solved by you just by you just um, clicking on forgetting password. Clicking on forgetting password means that you want to reset your password no matter the error. So you click on forget password. It's the same process. Type in your email here. Yeah? Let me use um assumemats at gmail.com. Then you click on reset password. Then you check your email for an instruction. <coughs> Excuse me. Check your email for an instruction. You can see. Then you click on this place. It's the same process, don't worry. Click on this place. Reset my password. Then you type your new password there. Let me still use one, two. Let me use six, five, four, three, two, one. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Of this password. Then I come here to log in. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. So you log in. All right. So that is. So you can see. Yeah. So that is it for how to access your M course. How to use your M course. You no, know, we talked about three things. How to access your M course. How to use your M course and how to access your prompting account. So if you have any of this um, instructions I give should help you access both. But if you still have further issues with accessing both your M course and prompting account, just send an email to help at promptn.com. All right, you can see it says if you if you encounter any issues, send an email to help at promptn.com. All right. So that is it for how to access your prompting account, how to use your prompting account, and how to access. Sorry, that is it for how to access your M course, how to use your M course, and how to access your prompting account. Yeah, thank you for watching to the end.